I really thoroughly enjoyed Veronica's Christmas song. I was really looking forward to this because I love Christmas specials of TV shows and Christmas themed episodes of sitcoms. And to begin with, it wasn't the most festive, but eventually it did get very Christmassy. This is the 10th episode of the first season of Veronica's Closet. And the main narrative involves Olive and Veronica auditioning for a choir. And it's very clear that one of them is definitely a better singer than the other. And I won't say which is which, but it might be obvious. And while there, Veronica also meets a rather brilliant character. Um, called Dan, played by Paul Satterfield, and I don't want to say too much about that character or what he brings to it, but I really enjoyed his interactions with Veronica. Um, I thought it was very well scripted. I thought the line about the pool um, I absolutely loved, because when Veronica said what she did just before Dan walked away, I thought, what on earth does she mean? And then it was clarified, and we have some brilliant facial expressions from Kirsty Alley, which we always do. Um, but it's one of the reasons why I love this show. I just think, I just love the character of Veronica. Um, really thoroughly enjoyed it. I don't want to say too much more about the narrative because obviously it's only 20 something minutes. I don't want to spoil too much of it, but there's a lot of singing in this and a lot of Christmas songs. Well, a moderate amount of Christmas song and it definitely, it, it, got, it got festive. It did. It took a bit of time, but eventually it got there. Really nice to have some different locations, different environments to what we're used to. Great mix of cast and characters, of course. Really thoroughly enjoyed it. So far, I'd say Veronica's Christmas Song might be one of my favourites. I know it's not a huge amount. I've only got 10 episodes in. But so far, I'd say it's one of my favourites. Really thoroughly enjoyed it.